Now, I know many of you probably seen, you know, the show called Botched. And that's, you know, when you, these women, you know, go on this show because they had messed up plastic surgeries. So the doctor's got to fix this. Well, this woman, I'm going to show you in this short clip. I, I, it has to be some Eastern European country just based off of the language that they, they're going to speak. But Lord, I want y'all to see this woman's face. I mean, and shit. Oh, Lord. Roll that clip. <laughs> you mean to tell me that you paid for that face? Seriously, I would love to see what her face looked like before she did that mess. I mean, why would you do that to your face? Let me tell you something. When you're doing that much craziness to your face, it's something in the inside with you that plastic surgery came and fix. Listen, plastic surgery is cool with me. I'm cool with plastic surgery. You know, them doctors can make, you know, women look, you know, definitely, you know, real good. They can, but it's limits to that, right? You know, I, just my personal opinion, would you do and sit on, on your body or whatever? That's one thing. When you start messing your face up, you know, you start trying to hold the cheekbones and do all, you got to be careful messing your face up. You, yes, your body too, but you know what? Your body is a little bit more forgiving than your face. You know, I know these women get the, their lips, you know, bigger now. And I'm like, what's wrong with the lips that you got? I mean, why you don't like them? You know what I'm saying? Um, you know, some people, they do need rhinoplasty. Some people do, because some people got some jacked up noses. And I'm not talking about, you know, a nose that's like my nose. Like some people, well, I don't like a black looking nose. I want a white nose. No, I'm not talking about that. I mean, some people literally have, at least in her group that you've seen, I've seen that a lot. They have their bones be in certain ways where their nose is like, no, they, they need rhinoplasty to fix that. And they, and they fix them up and they, they look all right. All right, cool. But why would you do all that mess? You know, she, obviously she didn't have the, the Botox and everything else on her lips. But why? I mean, you literally looking like a circus clown. You know what I'm saying? I'm saying that baby probably looking like, what the hell is going on with her face? Like, am I tripping? I'm like, is she really looking like this? I mean, how do you walk in public like that? What man want to fool with you? Could you imagine, fellas, like meeting her outside somewhere and going on to, the, you, you meet her and you're like, huh? And then, you know, some dudes are crazy. They're like, you know what? I want to go out with her just to see, just to really see what she got going on. Cause I know some of y'all are crazy. I would do that. And and then you sit there the whole time just looking at it like, and it's like, I gotta ask, like, why did you, I mean, like, when's the first time you had plastic surgery? You know, cause I mean, I know you weren't born that way. So what's the, you know, I like, I, I don't have to hear the story. Like, like, what is the deal? What doctor, you know, cause like say a, a, a reputable doctor would tell you, look, I don't want to do that. Because that's my name on the line. See, some of y'all going to these doctors and they, they don't worry about their name and their reputation. Like, hey, he's taking your money. Like, hey, whatever. I'm just going to do it, right? That's not the kind of doctor you want. You want a doctor to say, I don't want to do that surgery on you because I'm, your face going to turn out not looking right. And then you're going to tell people I did it and you're going to ruin my name. Hell no. But some of y'all going to Mexico and Dominican Republic and y'all going to all these different places to get plastic surgery. There was just one sister that just died in Mexico getting plastic surgery. Like, why would you do that? They make sure do it here in America. Yeah. You may pay a little more, but get you a board certified plastic surgeon that has a lot of work that to be shown and that you could check. Don't chop your face up to look like this woman in this video. You know, don't let anybody cut on you. And look, some people say, well, you shouldn't be doing plastic surgery anyway. Well, some people, you know, get plastic surgery for many reasons. Sometimes women, you know, they have that mommy makeover. Like when a woman have uh, children, and a woman breastfed, whatever, right? Well, a woman breastfed, her, her breast is not like it was when she was 21. So she get a breast lift. You know, some people get implants with that. You know, if, if a woman, um, you know, has C-sections, you know, it, it, it deadens that one part down there. And so a lot of times, you know, a doctor would tell a woman that, well, you know, like down the line, you don't have kids, you know, it'd probably be best to get a, get a tummy tuck, you know what I'm saying, to get rid of all that. So, I mean, it's different reasons why women do it. It's not all like, now some women take it too far. I get it. Like, you know, they get these BBLs and it just look ridiculous. And then you got some where they do it and it looks natural and it looks good on them. And that's the perfect ones to have. It's like, it looks good. It looks natural. You know, it's a, it's a fat transfer. It's not, you know, all this fake stuff they're putting in you or whatever. So I don't, I don't have nothing against plastic surgery. So I'm just saying, I don't like it when somebody do that mess you've seen in this video. Um, because like I said, I'm pretty sure her face 
did not look nothing like that prior to her letting somebody do that to her face. I mean, that woman looked utterly ridiculous. But leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about this one, ladies and gentlemen. You know, I mean, um, you know, how, how would you respond if you actually met her, you know, somewhere in the street? Would you stare? Would you double take? I mean, what would you do?